clean up the garage a little bit. It's been pretty dusty and spidery and all kinds of shit. So, didn't have anything to do. Decided to clean out the garage. Um, added a parts on my collection. I figured I'd show you guys. It's a 10 gallon air compressor. Make my job a little easier with all the shitty bolts I have to deal with. I got this Craftsman and I got the Craftsman uh, air ratchet. So, added that. That'll make things a lot nicer. Um, the X5 is at the shop. Pick getting the leaks fixed and stuff. Uh, the SCI is outside. I'm just cleaning the garage before I bring it in here and start working on it. Uh, turn this shit down. So, I think I showed this. Did I show this in the last video? Oh, maybe I didn't. So. That's the NVIDIA Catalyst downpipe. You guys have already seen that, but here's the equal length fighter that I got in the mail. It's a CNT equal length fighter. Um, it's like half the price, or even less, like a fourth of the price. No, like a third of the price of the Perrin equal length. And, uh,. I was skeptical at first, but now that I have it here, uh, I'm not worried at all. Because um, even the Perrin and the Tomies are known to crack. So, it, as long as you're not getting like straight eBay, like some $100 shit, you should be okay. I'd equate this to like a little bit better than Megan quality. Like you can see the welds on there. They're pretty damn good. This is a $325 header. So. So yeah, got that. Just waiting on my up pipe and my cat back, which should be here Tuesday and Wednesday. And then we're gonna install this crap, everything I got for the flex fuel, the injectors, the flex fuel kit, the fuel pump, all the exhaust components. Hopefully we'll get that done throughout the week. And then sometime next weekend, I'm gonna have my car dropped off at English Racing for the flex fuel tuning. It's gonna take them a few days, so I'm just gonna leave it there next weekend and they can finish it throughout the week. I need it back by that Friday though, because we're having another Subaru versus Evo meet at the drag strip. So hopefully my, my STI is done by then. That's pretty much it, I think for now. Yep, that's the only updates I have for you guys. I figured I'd just put a little update together while I was cleaning the garage. I'm pretty excited to get all these parts on. Finally, it's been a long, took longer than I thought to collect everything. Had some hiccups, but now we're all good. We'll see how we'll see how far we can take the stock block now that we have the X5 for a daily. I'm not worried about blowing the Subaru up, so we'll see what kind of power she can make and what kind of time she can put down. I'm gonna be going for 11s on the stock turbo because I got a 12.8 with just a downpipe and intake or a catted down pipe and intake and just an off the shelf tune, not even a pro tune. So uh, with E85 and all these bolt-ons, I should be really close. So we're gonna shoot for 11s on the stock VF turbo. So stick with me um, and we'll see what she can do. All right, later.